Diversity in Classrooms by Chadia Knight. Hi, my name is Chadia and I am an international student from the island of Grenada. While in the US, I have had many different experiences relating to diversity in different schools. As a result of those experiences, I wish to educate teachers about diversity of children. Diversity is the differences in characteristics, values, beliefs, and mannerism in individuals. It is important to identify the diversity of our students in our classroom. The main types of diversity educators may encounter in the classroom are culturally diverse children who have different cultural backgrounds such as religion, food, the way they eat and dress. Secondly, we have linguistically diverse children. These are children that speak a different language than the language spoken in the classroom. Finally, children of diverse families have families of different structure, size, and members of different age and gender. Children that are diverse usually have problems settling into the classroom. As teachers, it is our responsibility to provide comfort. Some difficulties that diverse students encounter are communication and language barriers, and disengaging in classroom. In fact, they sometimes struggle with academic development. Nonetheless, it is important to let diverse students feel welcomed into a classroom. When students feel welcomed, they feel respected and appreciated. Teachers should be knowledgeable about the ways to welcome diversity in classrooms, but most importantly, be creative. Here are some strategies you can implement in a diverse classroom. Frequently ask parents to visit the classroom. This will allow students to feel more secure. Moreover, host cultural events where parents can bring foods or items that represent their culture. Next, for a child speaking a different language, use terms in class activities and discussions that the student is familiar with. This will aid in the student's understanding of the topic. Lastly, explore different cultures and family types in class discussions. In doing so, reassure children that it is okay to be diverse. Subsequently, there are only positive outcomes when diverse students feel accepted and appreciated. Thus, teachers should make it mandatory in becoming knowledgeable about the diversity of their students. Firstly, the academic, cognitive, and social development of the children will increase. This is because healthy learning environments are created. Hence, students look forward to coming to the classroom and participating every day. And lastly, the relationship between the parents and teacher will be increased. Since parents become aware of the interests you have in the child's well-being. Teachers, Remember that you make a difference in the lives that you touch. Thus, if ever you encounter a diverse child in your classroom, I hope as educators you will apply this knowledge in your teaching career. Thanks for watching.